Previously on Dance Moms. Third place, Abby Lee Dance Company. The Chandelier video was nominated for four Grammys. I would love to put Abby in a situation where she isn't always the winner. I take offense that Holly thinks we're not there for her. You know what? Holly, please don't leave. Holly, please don't leave. I'm walking out the door. Please Holly. don't leave. Coming up on Dance Moms. Kathy has a whole new team. We are here to win, and Haley and I are out to get Abby. Maddie's second project with Sia was released today. I would be embarrassed about the video that your daughter was in. Okay. I can't see a grown okay. man like that. Sorry. Sorry. I will be sick to my stomach if my junior league competition team lets this imbecile beat us. They will never hear the end of it from me. Small group, first place. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, are you excited? Yes, I'm so proud of you. Mwah! Looks so good. Maddie's second project with the artist Sia was released today. It's called Elastic Heart. In the video, she danced alongside the famous actor, Shia LaBeouf. The concept is very abstract. She was hissing at him. She bit him. Now, I'm sure there's naysayers out there, but that's what's provocative about it. That's what artists do. So, Maddie, do you like it better than the other one? Uh, it's different. So why were you dirty? Because I was playing a wolf. And then we've been living in that cage for like a year, she said. Is he another animal? No, he, he's a person. How could a person be stuck in a cage with a wolf? I don't really understand the video, but it's artistic. And that means it's open for interpretation by the viewer. Who is that? Oh, <gasps> wait, wait, is that Candy Apples? That Candy yes! Apples. I look over at Kira's phone and I see a social media post from Kathy. She's competing against us this week and has a whole new team. I am freaking out. I am freaking out. That's Tessa. <gasps> Haley's on there. Every one of these people have been to multiple Abby auditions. And two of them are from Abby's competition show. Kathy has made a team out of all Abby's rejects. Oh my god, Abby is gonna flip out. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, move in, let's go! You are gonna be so mad. Kathy has a whole new team. All the kids from your auditions, including Haley and Tessa. Really? These two young ladies have been trying to get on my team forever. Now, the one little girl, Tessa, has become a beautiful dancer since her days on my competition show. And her mother, she's feisty, she's fun. We've actually become friends, if you will, since then. And I'm sure we will see you again soon. Thank you. Now, this Haley chick. The last time I saw this kid and her mother was at an open call audition. And I finally had to lay into her and tell her how despicable it was that she showed up outside a book signing that I was doing and signed my book. Haley's name was in the book. She was outside signing my book. You may go. You're done. So instead of thinking about her daughter's future, she's going to stoop to the level of dancing for Kathy. It's all about revenge for her. Now she has some girls that can really dance. Last week, the team came in third. If you lose to Kathy, I'm not going to have it. Well, we need to move on to the pyramid. Kendall and Nia. You both were given solos. Neither one of you placed in the top five. You don't place in the top five, I'm not going to see another solo for a while. OK. Moving on up, my next line is JoJo, Mackenzie, and Kalani. You were all in the group dance. I thought it was great. You took me back to that era. You could have all been extras in a movie. But the group dance didn't win. I want the Abby Lee Dance Company Junior League Competition team to blow everybody away. 
You understand? Yes. And on top of the pyramid is Maddie. You were our big winner in Philadelphia. You were the overall high score. Now, this weekend, we're competing at Energy National Dance Competition. To go against the candy apples. This week, there's no solos. In honor of Maddie's amazing duet with Shia LaBeouf, we are doing three duets. A duet relies on two people working together as one. Maddie, your duet partner is Kalani. <laughs> the name of your duet is Walking Through the Storm. Now, remember the last time you did a duet? It was lovely. When you are number one, there's nowhere to go but down. Our next duet, Jojo, you will be partnering up with Kendall. That's cute. Look at you. Oh, they're both funny? Well, that's good because it's inspired by the Disney movie Freaky Friday. That movie's a classic. I mean, you can't live unless you've seen Freaky Friday. But I really have to work hard this week because we switch bodies. And I am the total opposite of JoJo. I do not wear sequins, I do not wear rhinestones, and I don't live in Nebraska. All right, my last duet goes to Mackenzie and Nia. <laughs> the name of your routine is The Little Girl Who Lived Down the Lane. Is it scary? Yes, yeah, it sounds scary. scary. We like the scary. All right, now. We have a group routine. It's a little mystery. One of you gets killed. Oh, this is rough. Oh, oh. Maddie, you and Shia in the video. You have to act. The rest of you have to act too. Because in two weeks, the Abby Lee Dance Company will be back in LA. <laughs> exciting. My team came back from Los Angeles feeling defeated. But since then, we've evolved. And now, this is our chance to redeem ourselves. Whatever doesn't kill you will only make you stronger. So moms, let's go out the door. Goodbye, mothers. Bye. Go. You all are new, and I'd love to welcome you. I don't not like the team that just left, but we all needed a break because I am so over not winning. I have not won against Abby in two years. It's been two years. I need you to be my soldiers. Woo. Got it. That's okay. They are. Can I introduce your choreographer? This guy is the winner of So You Think You Can Dance. This is the real deal. <laughs> Keon was with me during nationals in LA and I adored working with him. So I offered Keon the opportunity to come back and work with my new premium team. I just wanna tell you something. We are here to win and to make you proud. Honestly, okay. I know you loved your other team, but just remember, Haley and I are out to get Abby. I'm excited for Abby to see all of my girls. They've all danced for Abby, but she let those girls slip through her fingers like grains of sand. I now have them, and they have a goal, and it's to win and to put Abby in her place. You have one thing to do this week, and that is to prove that you are no longer affiliated with Abby. I don't care whether she takes you to the Ritz, or she takes you to movies, or she comes up and coddles you. She is going to pull that. I want you to shun her. Oh, that's what I want to see. And if I don't see it, then you can pack your little Louis Vuittons, and you can move along and get your first plane ticket out of here. Let's stretch out. Let's go. Put some music on.
There's been a murder. There's a mystery. Who did it? Was there a weapon? Do we find the clue? The group routine is about the board game that I used to play as a child. Somebody was murdered, but I wonder who did it. I haven't a clue. Come on, let's go. We don't have time to waste. Turn those feet out, Mackenzie. I'm watching you. Don't sickle. OK. I think Mackenzie's a hot mess. Now the rest of you, you're not getting your characters. What? I still have your guys. <laughs> Whoever doesn't do the dance very well, so we can just lay him on the ground right now. It's looking like you. Now, see, this choreography looks different. Yeah, you're right but I don't know if it's going to be competitive, like a lyrical. Well, I would have to guess that Candy Apples will be doing a lyrical dance, because I think all, all those lyrical dancers dance? are lyrical. You gotta figure out who their choreographer is. Yeah, you could call them Tessa's mom. I know some of these moms from Abby's competition show, and these moms are crazy. Oh, Renee? Mm-hmm. Hey, is this Renee? It is. Hey, this is JoJo's mom, Jess. How about you get a f life? Oh! <gasps> Bitch. They are bitter apples. I oh want to know God. what's in her cereal this morning. The candy apple team. They have such a chip on their shoulder. They want to beat us so badly that they can't see straight. Video. Was it fun to shoot? It was so much fun to shoot. It was definitely the most tiring and the most dirty I've ever been. <laughs> Maddie's being interviewed today for her new video with Sia and Shia LaBeouf. It has really pushed the envelope, and Maddie has gotten so many phone calls. People Magazine, Good Morning America, Today Show. I mean, it's crazy. What would you say has been the, the, the toughest part of, uh, you know, the, the attention you've received since? Everyone asks me, what's what's the video about? Why are you chasing him? Right. What, what's... No one really understood the story of it, but I think that's what's cool about it because, you know, people are left with, like, a mystery. Like, they have to figure out what the story is. Right. I'm just so impressed with Maddie. She doesn't really get excited over anything, and she's just so humble. I don't know. It, it's a little crazy to me. Hey, thank you very much. Thank I really you. appreciate thank you guys' you. time. Listen for timing. Good. Together. I have a lot of great, amazing dancers this week. These girls have all danced for Abby, and now they're all mine. I feel like I've got this one in the bag. Stay together. Good recovery. I have one thing to say. You have a deep-seated reason to go after Abby. Make sure that I see that in your dancing. Prove to me this week that you are candy apple winners. I only want winners. Hello? It's TMZ. Hi. Hi. Um, we're doing a story on um, TMZ's video with Maddie. I'm too curious to hear what everyone has to say about it. Well, I almost threw up. I have to say that. I am flabbergasted. Yeah. I don't think that many yeah. parents out there would allow that. That was not art form to me. The video itself made me very uncomfortable. Abby likes to think Maddie is always the crowd pleaser, but she's been riding the wave for too long. It's time that she falls off the boogie board. All right, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. At the competition this weekend, I'm going to make sure that she does. The win is going to be ours. Straighten your back knee, Mackenzie. So the little girl down the lane thinks she's friends. But in reality, you're just bitterly jealous 
of the little girl that lived down the lane. She needs to like be crazy. There needs to be a moment where you just do this. Uh, this week, we are doing three duets in honor of her. Maddie's duet with Shia LaBeouf. Then you get a little Eva with her. Nia and Mackenzie. I was inspired by their work together as partners in National's big winning number last year, Amber Alert. Nia was the one that did all the partner work with Mackenzie. There's a bond there. They trust each other. Reach, head up on that. All right, girls, that's it. Let's get to the group routine. Where is Holly? She's downstairs. Hi, Aubrey, how are you? Hi, how's my little one? She's doing great. We're going back to LA in a couple of weeks, and she has been bugging me about this idea of doing a music video. Who is that? Aubrey? Yeah, yeah, I don't know that. if that's good. Maddie has this incredible relationship with Sia, who's a celebrity, and Nia also has a wonderful relationship with an, a celebrity. Recording the song of Aubrey O'Day has definitely developed her singing career. So y'all want to get started? Yeah, let's do this. Woo! Shit. Shit. Do you want to talk to her? I can get pull out of class. Do you want me to yeah, do? Yeah, oh, hold on one second. I'm going to go see if I can grab her. Hold on one second. Okay. And then we start to move. So. need to borrow you for one second. Oh my god, Nia needs to be in there. This is ridiculous. I mean, they could have done this phone call prior to rehearsal. Hello? Hi, little mama. It's Aubrey. Hi. One day of rehearsal. This is it. Just saying. It's not good for the kids. The kids need to all be in there. To pull Nia out of class, it's not fair to the other kids. If it was Maddie, I wouldn't have pulled her out of rehearsal. Hi, Hall. What is going on? Where have you been? We just had a conversation with Aubrey. Okay. It is so hard to get onto her schedule, and this was like the one window of time that she had available. Um, Melissa was pretty upset that Nia was not learning the dance with the girls. Oh my god, I love the lies right in front of me. You said it's not fair that she's doing this during group time. Yeah, f you. I did not. You don't know me. You don't know me. Nia also doesn't have the relationship where she can pull strings to have well, well, rehearsals think... rearranged so those things right. could happen. Right. Are you kidding me? Are you crazy? Crazy. Maddie's gone all of the time. We all know when Melissa needs to make a choice, her kids will come first over the team. She needs to stop. All right, let's see you two. Now, you two are my best dancers. Sometimes people look at a gorgeous girl on stage and they get a little jealous. Better be beautiful. Walk through the storm. OK, let's go. Kalani and Maddie, they're both beautiful dancers. However, everybody wants to see them fail. And the dancers that Kathy has solicited to be on her team this week, they are amazing kids with gorgeous legs and beautiful feet. So I'm expecting more from them. OK, I don't think there's any connection between the two of you. Maddie, you had more intensity, more connection with Shia LaBeouf than you do with Kalani, OK? Oh, my gosh. Kathy interviewed with TMZ about the video, which is ridiculous. What did she say? <coughs> um, Kathy told us she wanted to throw up when she saw it and would never let her daughter do that and talked crap about the cage. Did you see Sia apologize for the oh, video? Oh, I did see that. Sia yeah. apologized? Yeah, that if anyone are... was offended. Who was offended? People. People. Oh, I, I have not seen any negative stuff. I only watch, I don't look at negative so. Melissa, you and Abby shelter Maddie from everything. But she's famous now. She is going to find out sooner or later what people are saying about her, good or bad. Sometimes all it takes is one negative thing, oh, and people jump on that. Yes. Yeah. Don't care. It wow. They do. I wouldn't say don't care, because I think there are times well, we should care. But there's a lot. I so, do care what people say, but so. there's been so many great comments and on I, it. And I think you need a balance. So there's, there's right. a balance, because just like, not everybody likes my kid. Oh, well. And the Huffington Post right here, C apologizes for triggering concerns with the last Heart video. Whatever. 
I just hope that she comes to her senses and tells Maddie about it before Maddie hears it from someone else. They need to get into character, not getting into character. Remember when Maddie yesterday was telling you about Shia LaBeouf being a method actor, like he really gets into it? That's the same thing. Do the face now, get into character. Be method dancers. Kendall and JoJo's duet has a Freaky Friday theme. They switch personalities and act like one another. Grab it, and then turn around yourself. Right. Turn, 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 turn. Kendall looks like JoJo today. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> She's like, oh, I have this really big bow. And I'm like, oh my god, you can wear your lame. All right, let's see the group routine. Oh, the murder weapons. <gasps> oh my god, yes! <gasps> that is a noose. <laughs> Candlestick. This week's group number is inspired by Clue, the board game. I love this game. Yes, if you do that, then it's easier to set it down because it's higher. <laughs> How are you? Yes. Do you have a moment to talk? Sure. Maddie, we're gonna do an interview with Entertainment Tonight. <sighs> Is this different than Nia taking time out? No, it's the same. Oh, okay. Just wanna make sure. Entertainment Tonight comes in, and everything stops. Nia, JoJo, girls out of here. Rehearsal is over. Day before competition, our choreography isn't finished, and all Abby does is talk about how amazing Kathy's new kids are. This is not going to be good. We can't compete with, with no. Sia, with any of it. So why we can all go home, and Melissa, you can sit here, because this, we this is all we do. We this can't we do. compete with this, so no. why try? This could be the week that we lose to Candy Apples. <laughs> I have a whole new team of girls. They've all had empty promises from Abby and been overlooked by Abby. And I'm hoping that they will really come together and unite as a team and give us that victory that we're looking for. Oh, looky there, ALDC. Hmm, maybe we should go inside and snoop around. Shh. I think this is where Abby sits. OK. Oh, because they have two seats. Oh. <laughs> Well, we should probably get out of this room before they come in here. Or we could come out from the curtain. Oh, yeah, that one would be by hilarious. One. Yeah. Take your purses, ladies. Oh, look, they have bagels. Oh, they have food. Should yeah. we spit on them? <laughs> is that whole plate for Abby? Yeah. I'm sure it is. Oh. Those are more. Pass me a bagel. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come on. Shh. Come on. Let's go. Oh, it is cold. Jack in the box. Uh oh. Uh, moms, you weren't supposed to do that. Do you want to be on this team? I want to be on your yeah, team. Yeah, okay. Do you want to be, be on, on this team, team, Renee? Yeah, okay. Of course so, they want to uh, be on this team. They're not on your team. Just goes to show you make mistakes. Kathy, she has to be an idiot if she thinks that this new team is going to be loyal to her. These girls are so desperate to be on my team, they would come running to me at the drop of a hat. Do you guys want to touch JoJo's jacket? It might be the closest you'll ever get to an Abby Lee jacket. Woo! <laughs> Your daughter will and never be a star. star. You dream of being on. Actually, high. no. I don't want to be on your team. You I'm here with Kathy's team. Right. right. That's why you were at the audition? Right. OK. OK. These candy apple moms want to prove that they're better than the ALDC, but you're not. I mean, if you were, 
you would be where we are. Did I not tell you what she would do? That she would come up and embrace you in a hug? And no, 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 no. Because I've known her for years. Get your rodent butt out of my dressing room, because it says C-A-D-C. So take your 80s hairdo and your ass out of here. I don't swear. With all due respect, I'm oh, here really? to fight a war. I am part of this army now, and I am ready to conquer. So that's your goodbyes. That's your cue to leave. Go ahead. Be on her team. That's a war they want. Come on, bring it on. Adios. You okay, guys no have duets <laughs> this week, just like Maddie and Shia did. Right? Yeah. Do you think you'll get 22 million hits? Oh, come on, Kendall. <laughs> we can do it. Come on, we can do it, girls. You really have to act, and that's great preparation for LA. Make it count. It's all about your characters. You have to, like, tell the story so people, are, like, get it. Just kill it. The last time you guys had a duet, you won the whole competition, remember? Are you emotionally attached now? All right, girls. We have this competition this weekend and one more next weekend, and then we're back in LA. Uh, yeah, where you got your butts kicked. So let's go out and let's do your best, regardless of who else is here, what else they're doing. We're going out there, we're doing three duets. Maddie just did a duet. She did a duet with a grown man who isn't a dancer, but he acted. Got it? All right, girls, break a leg. play and act like Jojo. She's got to prove to Abby that she can act and that Maddie is not the only one. Easy to cheat, easy to lie. Easy to break, easy to cry. Easy to run, easy to hide. Everybody's fighting and fighting and Kendall and JoJo's duet is cute. I think they're adorable. Does cute win? We'll have to wait and see. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the little girl down the lane. Abby wants all the girls to act. And after last week, Mia definitely has to redeem herself. I'm feeling incredibly nervous for her right now. Love it. Same six steps. You know you're embarrassing yourself in front of all these people. I don't care. I would be embarrassed. 
about the video that your daughter was in. I can't see a grown man like that. Sorry. Clearly Sorry. Don't see that. Sorry. I would be embarrassed about the video that your daughter was in. Yeah. I tried to tell Melissa that there are people out there who don't like Sia's new video. And now Maddie has to hear it for the first time from this ignorant Candy Apple's mom right before she goes on stage. What do you all think? Are you all embarrassed at what Maddie did? Or do you love Maddie? Yeah. 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 I'm in shock right now. I just hope this nonsense doesn't affect her performance. There was never time to say goodbye When the waves are crashing down You close your eyes I am screaming inside. I just wanted to jump up and scream. I'm so proud of those girls. They walked through the storm with their heads held high, and those rotten candy apples didn't affect them at all. You do not sit in that audience and say anything negative about anybody because you never know whose mom or whose dad or whose grandparents are sitting around you. Why would you let your kid do that? Oh. My she God. would sell her kid she to would any sell Tom, Dick, I or agree. Harry on the street corner if she thought it would get her face on television. I will be sick to my stomach if my junior league competition team lets this horrible, wretched imbecile beat us. They will never hear the end of it from me. Good luck. Love you. OK. This has got to happen, all right? You're a great team. Go out there and get them. I haven't had a win against Abby in two years. A lot is at stake this week. I let my entire team go so that I could get a bunch of new girls and groom them. I really hope that we can pull out a victory. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage entry number 69, Get a Clue. My girls have to go out there and do their best. They know these girls that they're beautiful ballet dancers. So I think they're gonna be on their A game.
the group dance was good, I just don't know if it was enough to win. This week, knowing that Abby hand-selected Kathy's team, definitely we are feeling threatened. We're feeling intimidated. The kids lost almost the whole day of rehearsal. If this team beats us this week, it is definitely Abby's fault. has a lot of anguish against Abby and ALDC. We've got a lot of history. And these girls are hungry to take Abby and her girls down. other team was very interesting. I like the choreography. And if I lose to Kathy, I'm never going to forgive myself. Help everybody stand up! All right, we're going to get right to it. The duo, trio, overall, third place. Entry. The fact that Kendall was third, I thought she was great, but she'll do better next time. I'm sure of it. Second place. Entry 29, the little girl down the lane. You know what? With a second place win, I feel victorious. I think Mia and Kenzie should be delighted on our cloud nine. And in first place, entry number 27, walking through the score! My duets race to the finish line, win, place, and show. One, two, three. Finally, small group. Here we go. Now is the moment of truth. It's time for the group awards. I hope that my girls win, because we can't let that crab apples win. There's no way. Fourth place, entry number 56, Mirrors. Third place, entry number 70, Ethereal. Third place. Are you kidding me? I am in shock. And first place. Entry number 69, I could not be more upset. They were all over the place, and we were spotless. We were robbed. They thought they were going to come here and smoke everyone. It was not even a contest. It just goes to show you what Kathy just doesn't know what she's doing. Because there are beautiful dancers in that group. You girls were amazing. Stop it right now. Despite what happened out there, you know what? We're still happy to be with you. We are. Exactly. I mean, it's like that stupid clue dance was pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. JoJo and Kendall's terrible. I know. I mean, this is her. If that kid ever had any strength in her arms, it would be amazing. 
It's unbelievable to me. We're gonna come back next week. We'll pick ourselves up, we'll dust ourselves off, and we'll be even stronger and better. Next week, we're gonna go in a different direction with something that is extremely flawless. I promise you, we're going to give you a win. We will. Congratulations to all of you. Now, I just wish we could do this in LA. Next week, we're gonna have a very important week, and then we are on the road to Los Angeles. Yeah. Hollywood! Next on Dance Moms, we are going to Ohio, as Rotten Apples are going to be there again. I don't know if Spice Girls is good enough to win. If you guys don't win without Maddie, you know what that says to the whole world. Without being Maddie's little sister, who are you? Everyone associates her with Maddie. She can't remember a two-minute number. There's nothing I can do about it. She's Abby Lee Miller. Last week was our trial and error. There's no room for error this week. Second overall goes to act numbers.